Franken's victim dismisses his apology, drops new shocking truth bomb to make him resign. Leanne Tweeden is the KABC radio host who just exposed Senator Al Franken's alleged sexual harassment of her while they were part of the USO tour, entertaining the troops in the Middle East. Tweeden's shocking recollections, which she described as Harvey Weinstein-like behavior, caused Franken to issue a lame apology. However, Tweeden just revealed shocking new information that will cause him to resign. Leanne Tweeden, a well-known radio host in Los Angeles on CABC, accused Al Franken of sexually harassing her at a USO event back in 2006. Under the guise of practicing their kiss for a skit Franken wrote, Tweeden recounted the Harvey Weinstein-like behavior that Franken employed. Via CABC, Leanne wrote, like many USO shows before and since, the skits were full of sexual innuendo geared toward a young, male audience. As a TV host and sports broadcaster, as well as a model familiar to the audience from the covers of FHM, Maxim and Playboy, I was only expecting to MC and introduce the acts, but Franken said he had written a part for me that he thought would be funny, and I agreed to play along. So, Franken was aware of Leanne Tweedon's modeling. She had not appeared in Playboy yet, but he was aware that she had done modeling at that time, along the same lines as First Lady Melania Trump, tasteful, sexy photos, not pornography, which is what the liberal losers will no doubt accuse Leanne of doing, just like they did with Melania when Trump was running for president. Of course, regardless of the type of modeling, it is no reason to sexually harass anyone, but liberals will twist everything. Tweeden issued an initial statement and that was followed up with a more detailed on-air interview on Cab Los Angeles. She describes Franken in her initial statement, saying, Franken, repeated that actors really need to rehearse everything and that we must practice the kiss. I said okay so he would stop badgering me. We did the line leading up to the kiss and then he came at me, put his hand on the back of my head, mashed his lips against mine and aggressively stuck his tongue in my mouth. She continues, I immediately pushed him away with both of my hands against his chest and told him if he ever did that to me again I wouldn't be so nice about it the next time. I walked away. All I could think about was getting to a bathroom as fast as possible to rinse the taste of him out of my mouth. I felt disgusted and violated. Then, while on air after her statement on Franken had hit the press, she did a follow-up interview and described his badgering. She said, it was like that Harvey Weinstein tape, where he is pleading and then demanding the girl come into his hotel room. That is what Al was like when he kept insisting we practice this kiss. This incident was just the beginning of the tour, and Leanne would have to endure a Franken for a few weeks on the road. She did not want to upset the tour for the sake of the troops, so she let it go, telling close friends on the tour with her why she was no longer speaking with Franken. She recalls seeing Franken taking a publicity photo of her while on the bus and putting horns on it and making it look like a devil. He thought that was funny, but it was his way of telling her he was angry that she was ignoring him. Now, Franken has apologized in a lame statement, denying her testimony and saying that he does not remember it like that, but that does not address the one question Leanne Tweeden brought up after reading his apology. If he wants to apologize great, said Tweeden getting very emotional. But this happened 11 years ago, I saw him a couple of years ago at a USO gala with my husband and he walked up to me. He had a chance to apologize to me then. He knew what he did to me then, he knew what he did and that picture was out there. This means Franken should have no choice but to resign. He is calling for an ethics investigation into himself, how lame is that? What is there to investigate? The picture of Franken groping Tweeden while she was sleeping, as she describes that moment on the flight home as being dog tired, feeling like I had the flu, I had passed out and Al had someone take that pic, disgusting, is all that's need to indicate this guy is a scumbag. Al Franken is one of the biggest idiot, leftists in the Senate, a real Trump hater who has been pushing the fake Russia Trump investigation and joining in saying that Trump should be impeached. But, worse than all that, he is a sexual predator. Every American must call for his resignation immediately. He is not really sorry, he is only sorry he got caught. Caught, 